And now to present the final awards of the evening, please welcome to the stage Matt Damon and last year's Eddie recipient, Chris Rouse, ACE. All right. We're almost done. Is, am I the only one who like noticed the irony of, of the editing awards going on this long? <laughs> um, and, and like Frank Marshall, as an actor, believe me, I know what you guys do too. And I'm grateful for each and every one of you in this room. I'll stay here all night if I have to. Okay, uh, this year's feature film nominees are impressive. These films are all written impeccably with stories that capture our attention and never let go. The actors in these films bring out multi-layered characters that are moving, relatable, and at times downright terrifying. And of course, the director gives us the overall vision of the film. The scores are vivid, the productions are flawless, but it is the editor that takes all these elements and unifies them in a finished product. They bring the visions, the performances, the story, and all other aspects of production together to form these stunning works of art. Here are your nominees for Best Edited Feature Film, Comedy or Musical in 2014. All right. Birdman, Douglas Christ, and Stephen Mirioni, ACE. The Grand Budapest Hotel, Barney Pillen. Guardians of the Galaxy, Fred Raskin, Hughes Winborn, ACE, and Craig Wood, ACE. Inherit Vice, Leslie Jones, A.C.E. Into the Woods, Wyatt Smith. All right, really great work, everybody. And the Eddie goes to Barney Pilling for the Grand Budapest Hotel. Keep this brief. Uh, first, thanks uh, to Kirk Baxter for getting me a beer just before I got up on stage because I don't think I could have coped with this if he hadn't done that. Uh, nextly, to ACE, obviously, uh, I'm hugely honoured to be classed as one of your peers tonight. Uh, the room is so so full of editors whom I've watched over the years, many of whom have been on this stage or one quite like this somewhere else down the road. Um, and whose work I've learned from, not just appreciated, but learned from. So thank you for that. Uh, Jess, uh, my wonderful partner, mother of our children, uh, who takes the brunt of the sacrifice that you have to make to get these things. Um, stays at home, looks after the kids, and also um, post-produces Downton Abbey the last three years at the same time. Don't know how you do it, love. Thank you. Uh, Jeremy Dawson, wonderful producer, um, uh, uh, Stephen Perkins, my associate editor, uh, I couldn't have done it without him, um, Scott Rudin, uh, Stephen Rails, all at Fox Searchlight, uh, but obviously uh, Wes Anderson, I have to thank Wes, because his, his wonderful imagination and unique vision is, is, is why I'm here. Uh, and it's a gift to all of us, I think. And uh, yeah, thank you, Wes, and thank you, everybody. Thank you.